Welcome to the Month in Review Briefing. I am meteorologist Dr. Stefan Bita, the Climate Program Leader here at the National Weather Service Pendleton Office. This briefing will highlight the weather of February 2015. I will provide an overview of the February monthly statistics, a brief synopsis of significant February weather events, and discuss the March 2015 temperature and precipitation outlooks. This graphic is from the High Plains Regional Climate Center and shows the departure from normal values for the month of February 2015. The time period for the normals is 1981 to 2010. A value of zero would mean that the location reported a normal average temperature for the month of February. Southern Washington and central and northeast Oregon was above average with temperatures between 3 to 10 degrees above normal for the month. This resulted in many locations setting records in terms of daily and monthly temperatures. I will go over some of these records in the coming slides. The next graphic is also from the High Plains Regional Climate Center. This shows the percent of normal precipitation for the northwest for the month of February 2015. A value of 100% means that the location reported their average monthly total precipitation. The Lower Columbia Basin reported near to below normal precipitation. The east slopes of the Cascades, the John Day Highlands, the Blue Mountains, and the Wallowa Mountains reported near to above normal precipitation. Of the precipitation that fell, very little of it fell as snow. The east slopes of the Cascades reported having between 10 to 37 percent of their normal snow water equivalent, while the Blue Mountains reported between 40 to 72 percent of their nor normal snow water equivalent. Information about our monthly snowpack can be found in our snowpack and water supply briefing. February 5th to the 9th was characterized by a series of strong low pressure systems passing near or over the region, with strong southerly pressure gradients over southern Washington State and central and northeast Oregon. This provided for a couple of strong downslope wind events which, much like the, a similar event in early December 2014, brought a significant rise in temperatures due to descent and compressional warming. More low pressure systems would move over the area with abundant moisture bringing a subtropical air mass over the region through February 11th. A ridge of high pressure would follow the systems February 12th to the 14th and aid in the continued warm air advection over the region. The combination of these events resulted in several top 10 February record high temperatures being set in southern Washington State and central and northeast Oregon. Hermiston, Oregon tied its all-time February record high temperature of 68 degrees on February 7th, which was also recorded on February 12th, 2011. Meacham, Oregon tied its all-time February record high of 61 degrees on February 12th, which was also recorded on February 28, 1968. Walla Walla, Washington tied its third warmest February high temperature on record with 70 degrees on February 6th. The record is 75 degrees set on February 20th, 1995. Whitman Mission, Washington tied its fourth warmest February high temperature on record with 70 degrees on February 7th. The record is 76 degrees on February 25th, 1986. Ellensburg, Washington tied its fourth warmest February high temperature with 62 degrees on February 25th. The record is 66 degrees on February 28th, 1901. Yakima, Washington tied its fourth warmest February high temperature of 57 degrees on February 14th. The record is 69 degrees on February 23rd, 1947. La Grande, Oregon tied its sixth warmest February high temperature with 60, 63 degrees on February 8th and 9th. The record is 66 degrees on February 25th, 1986. Sadus Pass, Washington, tied its 8th warmest February high temperature with 59 degrees on February 13th. The record is 64 degrees on February 24th, 1995. Dayton, Washington, recorded its 10th warmest February high temperature with 67 degrees on February 6th. The record is 74 degrees on February 21st, 1995. The wind event of February 5th to the 7th also contributed to numerous top 10 warmest overnight low temperatures for the month of February being set. 
The mixing of the atmosphere due to the winds, the cloudy conditions that prevented radiational cooling, and the compressional warming due to downslope winds were the main factors for these elevated overnight low temperatures. Long Creek, Oregon set a new record warmest February overnight low temperature with 51 degrees on February 6th. The previous record was 47 degrees set on February 8, 1996. Meacham, Oregon set a new record warmest February overnight low temperature with 46 degrees on February 6th. The previous record was 43 degrees set on February 4, 1963. La Grande, Oregon tied its second warmest February overnight low temperature with 46 degrees on February 7th. The current record is 49 degrees set on February 27, 1980. Prineville, Oregon recorded its third warmest February overnight low temperature with 50 degrees on February 6th. The current record is 52 degrees set on February 19, 1995. Hermiston, Oregon tied its third warmest February overnight low temperature with 44 degrees on February 26th. The current record is 52 degrees set on February 24th, 1999. Dayton, Washington tied its fourth warmest February overnight low temperature with 52 degrees on February 6th. The current record is 55 degrees set on February 26th, 1932. Bend, Oregon tied its fourth warmest February overnight low temperature with 44 degrees on February 6. The current record is 47 degrees set on February 8, 1996. Hepner, Oregon tied its sixth warmest February overnight low temperature with 52 degrees on February 7. The current record is 56 degrees set on February 26, 1932. Ellensburg, Washington tied its sixth warmest February overnight low temperature with 40 degrees on February 7th. The current record is 44 degrees set on February 13th, 1971. Walla Walla, Washington tied its ninth warmest February overnight low temperature with 51 degrees set on February 7th. The current record is 55 degrees set on February 24th, 1986. Sisters, Oregon tied its 10th warmest February overnight low temperature with 42 degrees set on February 6th. The current record is 49 degrees set on February 19th, 1995. The mean synoptic pattern for the month of February 2015 was characterized with a ridge axis that was just off the Washington and Oregon coast. This helped keep the area dry by deflecting the main Arctic storm track well away from our area while allowing for an intrusion of a subtropical air mass into the region. As shown on the figure on the right, anomalously high values, or values that are above the expected climatological norm, were over the Pacific Northwest. A few record top 10 average February temperatures were set as a result of this continued unseasonal pattern. Numerous top 10 February average high temperatures were set throughout the region, which are too many to list in this presentation. Instead, I will focus on the stations that set their top two February average high temperatures. Keep in mind that these are average high temperatures, which is an average of all high temperatures recorded across the 28 days of the calendar month. The Dalles, Oregon set a new all-time February average high temperature of 55.6, breaking the previous record of 55.4 in 1967. Yakima, Washington set a new all-time February average high temperature of 55.5, breaking the previous record of 54.5 in 1967. Hermiston, Oregon set a new all-time February average high temperature of 54.6, far surpassing the previous record of 53.1 in 1991. Walla Walla, Washington set a new all-time February average high temperature of 54.5, breaking the previous record of 54.0 in 1991. La Grande, Oregon set a new all-time February average high temperature of 53.0 crushing the previous record of 49.6 in 1995. Meacham, Oregon set a new all-time February average high temperature of 47.6, breaking the previous record of 46.2 in 1963. Ellensburg, Washington set its second warmest February average high temperature of 51.8, with the current record being 53.5 in 1963. 
Condon, Oregon set its second warmest February average high temperature of 51.1, with the current record being 51.3 in 1963. Morrow, Oregon set its second warmest February average high temperature of 51.0, just shy of the current record of 51.1 in 1991. Numerous top 10 warmest February average low temperature records were set throughout the area, with too many to list for this presentation, so I'll focus on the top 5 rankings. It is interesting to note that no new records were set, and this may be due to the fog during the early portion of the month, followed by cloudy skies and rain that occurred through the middle of the month. Keep in mind that these are average low temperatures, which is an average of all low temperatures recorded across the 28 days of the calendar month. Hermiston, Oregon had its second warmest February average low temperature, 31.7, with the current record being 32.6 in 1999. Bickleton, Washington had its third warmest February average low temperature, 32.4, with the current record being 32.8 in 1958. The Dalles, Oregon had its fourth warmest February average low temperature, 36.8, with the current record being 38.3 in 1958. Walla Walla, Washington had its fourth warmest February average low temperature, 37.4, with the current record being 39.1 in 1958. Condon, Oregon had its fourth warmest February average low temperature, 32.4, with the current record being 33.4 in 1968. Yakima, Washington had its fourth warmest February average low temperature, 31.6, with the current record being 33.4 in 1958. La Grande, Oregon had its fourth warmest February average low temperature, 30.9, with the current record being 32.1 in 1983. Ellensburg, Washington had its fourth warmest average low temperature, 29.5, with the current record being 33.1 in 1958. Bend, Oregon had its fifth warmest February average low temperature of 29.4, with the current record being 30.9 in 1958. Long Creek, Oregon had its fifth warmest February average low temperature, 29.4, with the current record being 32.9 in 1958. The combination of record high temperatures and some locations reporting warm overnight lows helped contribute to several February numerous top 10 average temperatures records being set. I will only focus on those stations that set their top two February average temperatures and also focus on those near or around major population centers due to the sheer magnitude of the records that were set last month. The Dalles, Oregon set a new all-time record warmest February average temperature of 46.2, beating the previous record of 45.9 set in 1958. Yakima, Washington set a new all-time record warmest February average temperature of 43.5, beating the previous record of 42.7 set in 1958. Hermiston, Oregon set a new all-time record warmest February average temperature of 43.1, beating the previous record of 42.9 set in 1999. Walla Walla, Washington had its second warmest February average temperature of 46.0 with the current record being 46.3 set in 1958. Condon, Oregon had its second warmest February average temperature of 41.7 just shy of the current record of 41.8 set in 1958. Golden Dale, Washington had its second warmest February average temperature of 41.4, with the current record being 43.3 set in 1958. Meacham, Oregon had its second warmest February average temperature at 37.7, with the current record being 39.1 set in 1963. Redmond, Oregon had its fourth warmest February average temperature of 40.6, with the current record being 42.7 set in 1958. Bend, Oregon had its fourth warmest February average temperature of 40.5, with the current record being 41.3 set in 1930. Kennewick, Washington had its sixth warmest February average temperature of 44.6, with the current record being 47.5 set in 1961. This past winter had very few storms that produced any appreciable snowfall in our region. Precipitation amounts for the period of December 2014 to February 2015 were near average, but nearly all that fell in the form of rain. As a result, some locations reported their lowest 10 snowfall accumulation amounts for the meteorological winter, December to February. 
Due to the quality control process of climate data, snowfall amounts usually take longer for us to finalize. Therefore, this slide only shows those stations that we have received full and complete snowfall records this past winter. Yakima, Washington reported its lowest snowfall total this past winter with 1.6 inches, just barely beating the prior record of 1.7 inches set during the winter of 1957 and 1958. Meacham, Oregon reported its lowest snowfall total this past winter with 30.2 inches, beating the previous record of 35.4 inches set during the winter of 1962 and 1963. Walla Walla, Washington reported its fourth lowest snowfall total this past winter with 0.5 inches, with the current record holder being no snow reported during the winter of 2004 and 2005. Pendleton, Oregon reported its seventh lowest snowfall total this past winter with 2.6 inches, with the current record being no snow reported during the winter of 1930 and 1931. Redmond, Oregon reported its tenth lowest snowfall total this past winter with 5.3 inches, with the current record being 1.2 inches reported during the winter of 1930 and 1931. We turn our attention to the significant weather in the month of February 2015. An active weather pattern during the first half of February brought a series of low pressure systems near or over the region with strong southerly pressure gradients during the period of February 5th to the 9th. The successive wave of systems brought two significant periods of strong winds to the region that mainly favored the lee side or downslope areas of central and northeast Oregon. Provided on this slide are the selected reports of the locations and wind speeds reported throughout the event. Nearly all reports listed came in on February 6th, as this event had the most favorable weather conditions that produced the strongest winds. Widespread reports of downed trees and power lines were received throughout the period, with nearly all reports coming in from central Oregon. And now we will turn our attention to the climate forecast for March 2015. The Climate Prediction Center issued an El Nino advisory due to warmer than normal sea surface temperature across mainly the central tropical Pacific Ocean. Their forecast states that there is a 50 to 60 percent chance that El Nino conditions will persist through the northern hemisphere summer of this year. The next two slides will provide the outlook for the month of March and what impacts this late season El Nino development may have on our region. This graphic is issued by the Climate Prediction Center, or CPC, and is the temperature outlook for the month of March. The cool colors indicate a greater chance of below normal temperatures, and the warm colors represent a greater chance of above normal temperatures. The time period for the normals runs from 1981 to 2010. The Pacific Northwest is forecast to have a greater chance of above normal temperatures for the month of March. This graphic is CPC's precipitation outlook for the month of March. The green colors represent a greater chance of above normal precipitation, and the brown colors represent a greater chance of below normal precipitation. The region east of the Cascades has a greater chance of below normal precipitation, while the far eastern Blue Mountains and the Wilhelm Mountains in northeast Oregon will experience an equal chance of above normal, near normal, or below normal precipitation. Please remember that these are probabilities of averages, and that the day-to-day -day weather will still vary for the month of March. This concludes our briefing. Please continue to visit National Weather Service webpages for the latest weather information, including watches, warnings, and advisories. Thank you for your time.